everyone, it's Derek Carter from Tech Dudes, and uh, this video is going to be about the Alienware M11X uh, stability test, and just to see what the temperatures get up to, see how cool it stays. Alright, so right now it's been idling for about 30 minutes or so, and minimum 40 degrees Celsius CPU. And for the GT335M, minimum has been 41. Alright. So that's the idle temps. Oops. I'm going to go ahead and start up Fermark for the GPU stability test. And go. Also, I'm going to start up Prime95 at the same time for the CPU um, part of it. And torture test. Small FFT. Okay. Okay, that's running. And so is Fermark. And I will come back with the results. Uh, I'm going to leave this on for however long it takes for it to get to maximum temperature and I'll come back. Okay guys, after running um, Fermark and Prime95 for 20 minutes the temperatures seem to have stabilized and here what, here's what they are. Okay, so 58 degrees for the first core and the second core is 57 and that's the highest it got to. Now down here in GPU, the highest it got to, it's stabilized at 61. And these temperatures are actually really good, I think, because the CPU only went up 17 degrees from idle under a full load for 20 minutes, and the GPU um, just went up 20 degrees from idle. And another thing to note, the CPU, I um, it's actually overclocked to 1.73 gigahertz. It's not at the stock 1.3, so that's another impressive thing. It's that low, especially for a notebook of this size. There, you know, you you can't get much cooling in there, and what they have, it's really good. I'm really impressed with these numbers here. Well, I hope this was helpful to you guys, and if you and I would recommend the Alienware M11X to anybody at all. Whether you're just, you know, using it just for a school computer or a, something if you're in college just to have really ultra portable. Or if you're a gamer and you already have a really powerful desktop. Um, this is just a great mobile gaming computer. And even if you don't have the an ultra powerful desktop, this is just incredible for a gaming uh, computer. Well, alright, Derek Carter from Tech Dudes. I uh, hope to catch you guys real soon.